So today I'm talking about the EVGA Supernova 1300 G2. Now it's a power supply from EVGA and it's 1300 watts. Oh, and it's also gold. So it, the name kind of just, you know, tells you what it is. Now it's based on the Superflower Leadex design, which is very, it's very, very high end. Um, it's a very, very good power supply. So in turn, this one is a very good power supply. Now let's open it up and see what we get. Well, it comes with a case for all your cables, which is nice. It comes with a cable for the wall, which is to be expected. And cables. Lots of them. Lots and lots of cables. Now, I don't know if... Okay. So, right here are the graphics card cables. Now, as you can tell, there are a lot of them. And that's for good reason, because it can handle a lot of graphics cards. It comes with four, six, eight, six plus two pins, and then it comes with two, which are six plus two and a six pin together. Now, the red, which is fine, maybe for a lot of people, but not for me. And as you can see, my build, it's not exactly very friendly towards red. It doesn't fit at all. But that's okay, because EVGA does offer a um, kit, which you can get in blue, red, black, or white which are individually sleeved and look incredible. I am going to be picking up a set and reviewing them as well. It comes in soft foam, what you want to see. Okay, it's big, it's got a 40 millimeter fan. It's got all the connections in the world. Now, a power supply is, to some people is a power supply. It powers your computer and it's done. Well, not really. I mean, there are a lot of factors into it, like ripple suppression, all the types of technology it has, like over voltage protection, over current protection, under voltage, undercurrent, things like that. All play a big role in a power supply. And if you are to cheap out, cheap out on something else, because a power supply is not something to cheap out on. It's something that keeps all of your components alive. That is obviously that's the last thing you want to go. Would I buy this again? Yeah. You know why? It's backed by a company I believe in. It's a lot of wattage for very cheap. It's gold rated, so it's also very efficient. Are there any reasons to go above this in wattage and, you know, for spending more money? Yes, I mean, there are. In some situations, it could be necessary, such as benching with more graphics cards or liquid nitrogen with more than one car. So yes, there are reasons that you could go above this, but for a prosumer who wants two, maybe three graphics cards with an X79 setup or their upcoming X99 setup, this is what I would recommend. It's a great power supply. It's very cheap for the quality that you get. And... It's backed by a company that will back you up.